guys, Hayden here, bringing you another tutorial on Designs Academy. Um, this is a, uh, you know, an unknown tutorial. Well, not unknown tutorial, but a unknown plugin. Now, this plugin is a, uh, what I mean by it's unknown is not many people know it, or know about it, or know how to use it. So I'm here to teach you, spread my knowledge on how to use it. So basically, it's actually really simple. Uh, you mommy, you my, mammy, I don't know how you pronounce that, but anyway, this is a random spline generator, so this would be useful for, like, if you wanted to make a vine banner, you could do this for the background instead of just having black and then, like, a vine render it wouldn't really make sense. So you could use this, or you could make your own using Reaper X, but that's up to you. But I'm going to show you how to do this by, uh, if you hold this orange circle or not circle line thing if you click it uh, you can use any of these besides these orange ones here and vectorizer helix and text you can use all the rest of these to make a cool spline now I'm gonna use a circle because hey let's do the basics so you're gonna have the circle right here and the plugin uh, by the way I forgot to mention this plugin is free you can just search you mammy you mommy I don't know but search that, you can download it, install it as if it was any other plugin. So, pretty simple. Um, but let me give you some knowledge on how all these works. You probably know what they are. Uh, random seeds, you know, randomizes it. I'm actually going to keep it at, you know, where it was. Oops. Okay, good. Yeah, okay. So, keep it there. And then, number of segments is basically how tall it is. I'm going to keep it about right there. And then number is, you know, kind of self-explanatory number of splines. I have it at eight, I guess. Uh, you know, this stuff, pretty self-explanatory. Now down here is basically uh, where you could set up presets. Now, I have a preset for you, which is uh, 180 on all of them. Well, just the right side, actually. Not all of them, but the right three sides. So 180 here. Or if you want another cool preset, which Sesso HQ did, is uh, 360, which I guess for the sake of this tutorial, we'll use that one. Uh, but this is the one Sesso HQ made. I don't know if you know of them or not. Uh, but here's a cool little preset you could do. Uh, it's kind of randomized, but basically, as you can see, it's just black lines now, and it's not much. You know, you can't really do anything with it. So basically, what you got to do is you got to go to a mesh. You just want to drag this circle down to the profile, right? Yeah, profile spline. Okay, and you're gonna notice this thing here, which uh, obviously it's kind of ugly. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to this circle right here, and we're gonna change the radius to about 24, I'd say. But as you can see here, we got a nice little, you know, vine or not vine up, like you know, little spline here. You could add your nice little materials and like you know. Add your logo in there and make it all cool. It's actually not looking half bad. <laughs> but, yeah. You can make it as thick as you want. Uh, 60. I don't know. Oh, it's alright. You can put your render there. Uh, you can make it 10. You get the idea. But you just gotta duplicate these. There you go. You got two now. You know, it's self explanatory. Um, I don't know too much about this plugin. I just know how to do that. Um, but I, knew, I do know that you could do many, many things with this. You could just got to, you know, kind of experiment with this a little bit. Like, you see that? See what I just did there? I don't know what it's really doing. But you get the idea of this tutorial. Um, but I hope this tutorial helped you guys out a little bit. Um, you know, it's kind of an unknown tutorial, so you could, you know, if you're learning graphic design with your friends, you could show them off this epic looking thing in your banner but like how'd you do that and then like you'll be that guy who doesn't tell them so then they'll like beg for it you know stuff like that be that guy but uh anyway hope you enjoyed this quick little tutorial on how to do this um if you want to stay up to date with us follow us on twitter and our shop is now available well, i guess it's been available but you could like buy stuff you know you could buy a mug i mean that's how far we went in this whole shop thing but anyway, that is all for this tutorial, guys. Um, I'm out. Peace.